Hello guys, so today I'm going to show you how to share your Google Calendar with other people. Now it's a very simple task. So firstly what you have to do is to simply click on the gear icon over here, click on that, then go to settings. Now over here you will find multiple options. So don't worry, all you have to do is just simply click on your calendar name or your email address or your company name, whatever it is written. So click on this. Now over here you will find the access of calendar. So scroll down and over there you will find the option for share with specific people or group. Now just simply click on add people and group. Then just simply choose the person who you want to give the access of your calendar so click on that email address now so you can add multiple people just by clicking over here and choosing the email address or just simply type in the email address manually so for this tutorial i'm going to add only one person now after you have added the person set the permissions so click on the drop box now over here you will find four options so the first option is see only free busy high details meaning the first option will mostly hide all the details but it will show are you free or busy the second one is see all event details so if you choose this the person that you are adding will be able to see every detail in your calendar including your title your location date everything now the third option is make changes to event now so if you're choosing this option it means so you are giving the other person rights to change your details so in most cases this might be your assistant your secretary and that's it so and the last one which is make changes and manage sharing so this is the most top level administrative permission and you should only give this to a very particular few people so just simply choose a permission then just simply click on send and now when they will open the email and click on the calendar link that you just sent them they will be able to see your calendar all the time now there is one more setting that you can do is that you can make your calendar public so people can look into your calendar and can book an appointment if you want to so to make that public all you have to do is just simply check this box over here then over here it will show you a warning read it carefully then hit ok now to get the link for public calendar scroll down and over here you will find the public url for calendar double click it and check it whether it is working or not so just simply open a new incognito tab and see whether your calendar is working or not so as you can see my calendar is working just fine and all of the details are shown over here correctly so that's it and thank you for watching and do like and subscribe to my channel and take care